हेलो फ्रेंड्स सत्येंद्र हियर एंड इन दिस वीडियो लेट्स टॉक अबाउट द बुलियन ऑपरेशन इन क्रियो पैरामेट्रिक सो लेट्स गेट स्टार्टेड सो फर्स्ट लेट्स अंडरस्टैंड व्हाई इट इज नीडेड एंड देन विल सी द प्रोसीजर सो सम टाइम व्हेन यू हैव अ वेरी कॉम्प्लेक्स पार्ट अ पार्ट लाइक दिस दिस इज अ थ्री मॉडल फॉर अ पंप दिस इज कंप्लीटली डन यूजिंग सरफेसिंग सो इफ आई चेंज द विजुअल स्टाइल इट लुक्स लाइक दिस एंड इफ यू सी द सेक्शन व्यू it looks like this so this complete part is done using surfacing and this part is having one cut out which is this one this is the cut out and if i open this cut out separately it looks like this so creating this kind of cut out directly within this part is really a difficult task so in such cases boolean helps a lot you can create this entire feature separately outside this part and you can call it to create this feature within this part using boolean so this was the need of boolean now let's see the procedure so if i edit this feature these three are the boolean operation this is union this is subtract and this is intersect now let's understand boolean in detail and for that i have a separate part now here i'll call another part to create a feature so go to get data merge inheritance now here you have three boolean operations this is union this is subtract and this is intersect so first you need to call the part just like this it will open one assembly window now start assembling this part using these datums and once you have assembled your part say okay So now you got one external merge ID. You can right click and open this feature separately. Now here any changes you do. It get updated there. If you edit this feature, you have this three boolean operation. So based on this selection you get the result. So if you go for subtract and say okay, it will remove the material. if you go for intersect you get the common material from both the part one more option we have inside this which is toggle inheritance so if you select this and say okay you get additional advantage now you have the model tree So this helps when you are trying to add this dimension in your family table. So if this option is unchecked, you won't get any model tree. So now this is external inheritance, and if you uncheck, it will be external merge. Now this option, this is helpful when you want to reposition your external part. So you can click it, and you can once again modify this assembly. So this was the boolean operation for the part level. Now the same boolean operation can be used for assembly level. So using boolean operation, you can convert the entire assembly into a single part. And for that, I have a separate video. The link will be given in the description area, and it will come at the end of this video. So this was the boolean operation in Creo Parametric, and I hope this video will be helpful. Now you can like this video if you find this video helpful, and I'll see you in my next video. Thank you.